one of my oldest ones, which is a package from High Smile. So I finished using the Whitening and Lightening brand. And honestly, like I didn't really see much difference on my teeth. I want to try this one. My friend has tried this one and apparently it works. I thought I'd give it a go. I didn't believe it at first because Whitening and Lightening was really popular back in the day. YouTubers were like promoting it. Even YouTubers that I trust. I still trust them and I reckon that it just didn't work for me or I didn't do it properly. I really didn't see a difference on my teeth but I still think that it did work for some people. I ended up getting High Smile next because my friend did use it and she reckons it works. It was promoted on Snapchat and like a lot of like celebrities were promoting it I think a couple of months ago. That didn't really make a difference to me just because the whitening and lightening had so much promotions as well and it didn't do anything for me. I guess my friend kind of persuaded me to get this and give it a go. So hopefully it works. I've had it for months and I can't believe I haven't even tried it, but I guess I'm just over trying to whiten my teeth. I guess on camera, it looks lighter than it actually is. I drink a lot of coffee. I drink coffee in the morning. I don't know why they look whiter today. That's weird. It's probably my lipstick, but yeah, they can go whiter. So the box that it comes with, I think it's so cute. I could actually use this box. I've been looking for boxes to like organize my drawer and this is the perfect size. So I'm actually gonna keep that. So let's open this and I'll probably film a like first impression on this and hopefully it's not a disaster and I'll actually notice something. With the whitening and lightening, I actually like wondered like is it really working? Um, maybe it's working like did my teeth go whiter? But if I have to ask myself that, I don't think it's working like I should be able to see just at least a tiny difference to make me aware that it's working. I felt like it was like a placebo thing. I'd be like, I think it's getting whiter, but I don't think it did. So this is the box. This is such a cute box as well. I think I could definitely use this to organize my drawers. Ooh, that looks so good. How cute does this look? This is packaged so much better than whitening and lightening. I can barely remember the packaging, but I'm pretty sure I wasn't as impressed as I am with this. So the box is sturdy. I guess that doesn't really matter, but you know. And then we get three of this syringe solution. I guess this is the whitening, like the bleaching part of it. The whitening and lightening had one. These are smaller. I gotta read the instructions on how to actually use this because it might be just a little bit different. Is this like the UV light? Is that what it's called? But they had this as well. And I love the white color. It makes it look so clean and like dentist-like. And then we have this. I'm not sure what this is for because whitening and lightening didn't have this. So it goes in your mouth. And then what? And then this goes like that. So this actually doesn't touch your teeth. Maybe. Yeah, it looks like that goes over this goes over your teeth and then you use a uv light which is interesting because whitening and lightening didn't have this i'm not sure what this is for and how this benefits your teeth i think it says that this isn't meant to touch your teeth how everyone was promoting it was like they just would leave it on in their mouth because it is 20 minutes it's a long time i don't think i'll be able to like keep holding it and like make sure it won't be touching my teeth so the gel contains pomegranate aloe vera chamomile Tap and hydroxy... What the fuck is that? It looks like it's like not as strong. It's more natural with the aloe vera and the chamomile and the pomegranate. So that's the key ingredients on this syringe. I remember the other product was like, it was meant to be a strong product. So I was actually quite surprised that it didn't really do anything to my teeth. It's natural, but does it mean that it won't work? You use this to check how yellow, like what color yellow your teeth is and then where it goes for improvements. And it's saying take before and after photos to compare results. So I seem really confident that it works. Use for six consecutive nights. Limit or avoid food that will stain your teeth. I mean, not coffee. Brush before whitening. Yeah, I reckon. Use one application at night before bed. So I can do this every night. I can't start tonight because I need to film it. Maybe I'll start 
on the weekend on Saturday and then go from there hopefully there's positive results hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video I've been wanting to film for a very long time it's the review and first impression of the high smile teeth whitening kit I got this quite a while ago and I just haven't gotten around to filming the video so I thought I'd do it today the very first whitening kit that I've tried is the whitening lightning because every youtuber back in the day was raving about it and I saw this high smile on snapchat and I thought which one should I get and so because I wanted to try that one first I went with that one and I honestly don't really see what the rave was about because it didn't really work on me I don't know why and my friend actually did a review on this high smile and she reckons it works so i thought i'd give it a go because who doesn't want white teeth right in the box we get these syringes and this has the instructions and then you kind of see what color teeth you have and try and see the difference so let's have a look brush before whitening i brushed my teeth use that one application at night before bed oh you're meant to use it before bed but it's literally really early in the morning i guess i'll try not to eat too much i don't know if that's why you're meant to use it before bed take before and after photos to compare results so let's do that actually i can't because my phone is filming but I lost that card so I can't really tell how white my like I can't measure it with that card and I also don't have the instructions so I'm just gonna kind of search it online the back of the box has instructions open cover to remove plastic tag from LED light battery so it's LED light so ooh. okay so that works attach the mouth tray to the LED like that I love that. I already like this more because of this part that goes in your mouth. We're gonna grab one of these syringe with the gel. And I feel like my teeth already know something's gonna happen because they're like more sensitive than usual now. Apply a fourth gel to the top of the tray along the line. There's the measurements. A fourth, a fourth, a fourth here. Apply it on the bottom as well to like another fourth on the bottom widen for 10 minutes rinse and repeat daily so i have to do this every day there's three key ingredients in the gels there's three gels and it has three ml each it has pomegranate aloe vera chamomile and pap and hydro hydroxyapatite excited whitening lightning you actually have to there's a syringe and there's like a brush and then you brush the gel on your teeth and you have to make sure it's dry and there's so many like things that go with it there's like a q-tip that dries the teeth and then like another like like cotton tissue type to dry the teeth as well and like the gums and then there's also that sort of oil that you put on your gums so the gel doesn't like burn it or something like that so this is so easy you just put it on top of here put it at the bottom stick it on 10 minutes and you're done but don't forget to brush your teeth before or else it could get patchy because you don't want gunk like covering your teeth and that's not gonna you know whiten it so let's do it all right let's do it ah! my teeth doesn't look that yellow uh lipstick I do drink a lot of coffee, so there are like yellow stains in there. This is like my first time, I mean, if it works, it'll be like the first time I get white teeth. You're meant to remove this top part because that closes it. So you get this. Oh, you can put a, oh my God, you put a, oh, you put a lot in there. That's a lot. See, with the other one, it's like, it says how much you should use, but I feel like I feel like I'm using too much, like I'm brushing too much on and I can feel it like, it, like it's not bad, it's not burning but you get that like burning, tingling sensation and I feel like oh my god that's probably too much and so I don't, I guess I didn't end up using enough but this it's just easier because you wanna get it all over this if you're not brushing it on 
but if you had to brush that on your teeth it'd just be too much one fourth on the other side That was actually a nice process and easy. I really like it already. This was all messy with my lipstick, so I washed it. What I really like about it is that it fits really nicely in your mouth. It feels very secure. A lot of saliva will accumulate in 10 minutes, and so there's no like leaking. See how it's soft and it's like silicone? You can bite into it and like exercise your jaw if you feel tired. You can't do that with the other one. The taste wasn't bad. It wasn't burning at all. There was that tingling feel to it. My tongue would touch like the back of my teeth and that's where there's a lot of gel. By like the end of the 10 minutes, my tongue started to feel numb. So there's no burning sensation, nothing, no burning in your gums and there's no sensitivity feeling on your teeth. I don't know, if you've got sensitive teeth and you drink like hot or cold water or you eat something sweet, you get that really yucky feeling. I'm very sensitive and I didn't get that at all with this. With the whitening lightning, I did. And I really like how there's a lot of product that can really coat your whole teeth without having to brush it on. Time itself for 10 minutes when you turn it on. I don't know if it resets when you turn it off. So 10 minutes, you don't actually have to time it. I was timing it on my TV, but it actually turns off by itself in 10 minutes. So just be aware when you put it in and when you turn it on, it's like the 10 minutes starts there. So color wise, I don't notice anything like significant where I actually see a difference. I'm gonna try and use it every day until I finish it and then I'll come back and film the results. To be fair, I didn't use whitening lightning every single day just because the application was time consuming and it just wasn't as easy as this. But I reckon I could do this every night. So I'm gonna try and do that and hopefully we'll see like a big difference. When I finish this, we'll see something that's changed and I'm actually really excited for it. There's much of a difference, like I definitely can't tell. Not gonna lie, I can't wait till I finish all of this and use it properly every night and then come back and see the results. I will see you on my next video, bye.